Now, I absolutely love a family business and the story behind family businesses, but I also equally love British brands. And it's fantastic to see um, a British family brand here at the show. Sam, just tell us a little bit about PA, first of all, because I think it's great to be able to highlight these brands in the show. Okay, so we are a third generation family business, as you said, founded by my grandfather in 1963, manufacturing all our equipment in the UK, in Nutsford, in Cheshire. Um, proud to be British, proud to be manufacturing and leading the charge. So what makes you guys stand out from others in the industry? Okay, so one of the things we've been looking at both internally as a business is improving efficiency, but also how we can help our customers to improve efficiency. So by making it very clear visually on the machines, whether their machines are operating at 100% efficiency or even above. So for example, we've developed this screen which is giving really clear graphics. Um, you can see here, if you can see closely, that the machine's green at the moment and it's running at 108% efficiency. If for whatever reason the machine's not being fed at the um, highest speed that they can achieve, then the machine will actually drop below 100% efficiency and the colour on the, the screen, the machine itself, will change colour to either amber or red. So anybody in a production facility standing back will be able to see quite clearly whether the machine's being fed at an efficient rate. So what happened in the past without this screen then? Did they, did they just not know that the machine was running yeah, inefficiently? They, they, they probably look at the end of the day at the statistics for that line and then see... You missed the boat then though, haven't you? The boat, um, not really understand what had happened at that point in time, perhaps blame the machinery without understanding really that they'd not been feeding the machine um, quick enough and there was a, actually a problem further upstream in their equipment. So now for the production guys, they can see quite clearly at that point in time and address it there and then rather than wait until it's too late. And is this something that has been fed back to you by your customers, that this is something that was kind of missing really and then you've listened and adapted from there? Yeah, what we tend to do is talk to our customers and try and understand the problems that they're having within their factory. And I think because we are manufacturers ourselves, we are running machines not tray sealing machines but we're manufacturing cutting bits of metal using machinery so we've tried to put um, efficiency measures within our factory and make it clear and use clear visuals and then we've translated that for our customers into a clear visual that they can use. And I suppose as well as it being efficient, you're also um, making it easy for people to come on board as staff to be able to come and run a machine as well, Absolutely. which is really key, I think, because otherwise if you need somebody that's highly trained to be able to come and do a job like that, then the staff is a huge problem at the moment. Well, you've hit the nail on the head, really. This, there's no language barrier here with this, and we know in a lot of the food factories that there's, there isn't a lot of English. Um, and also people like nowadays things to be really interactive and easy to see. Um, we can actually even click onto different parts of the machine and it will actually go through to the settings for that machine but to be able to see quite clearly that there is a problem and then to be able to get to the root cause of it quickly. Oh well I love it, well well done Sam and uh, yeah keep promoting British brands. Well done. <laughs>